Hello guys, welcome back to Transport Fever 2 in the USA Heart mode later. We can see the new setup for grain deliveries that we created in the previous episode. Working flawlessly here, this beautiful train is going to collect the grain and bring it to Pittsburgh and from there to Boston. And that's of course thanks to the new setup here that we created for Kansas City. Today we have to continue expanding this, primarily expanding more. Alright, so one of the first things that we have to do is make sure we know where is the future I was going to pass through, so that's what I did in the beginning. And of course, building the road where our station is going to connect to the city, building the bus and the cargo stations. Space for cargo deliveries. Changing the names. And now, placing the base of the station close to the road. And now, of course, we have to build the station. You have already seen this. But for anyone who hasn't, please enjoy. This time I decided to have the high speed rail. I guess we can afford it and maybe it's time. Looks a little bit better, arguably. Fortunately for me, the game was actually pretty fast this time around. Adding the underpasses and the roofs. A little mistake over there. And our shiny new station is ready. Of course, giving it a better name. And now, the rail for incoming and outgoing traffic. As you can see on the outside part, it's a little bit uh, steep, but it's not going to be a huge problem. Deleting the road there so that it doesn't prevent me from adding the returning rail turn. And I seem to have forgotten the junctions inside. And this one, of course, didn't want to work. So it's going to take a while. Things happen sometimes.
There we go. This time I decided to go with 40 degrees on this side. One thing I quickly realized is that I will probably have to make a turn here. Otherwise it's not going to be very realistic digging into the hill. That's definitely a little bit better. when you have a situation like that it's a little bit harder to get the connections so they take more time and more length here I will have to yeah connect the one of the cargo terminals to the first exit but what can you do as you can see I tried to see if I have another option but not really and here I think 20 degrees would be enough because we already have somewhat of a turn now just finishing the tunnels under the station yeah i decided that i'm not going to bother with that side of the connections because we're not going to use it but we definitely need the connection to Kansas and then down to Austin. Maybe Oklahoma as well, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. The, uh, the one that the game offers was not that bad with a few small details, but I didn't like it in the end, so I decided to go with my own. Now I'm thinking that I will have to have a station here for the grain that I'm going to deliver. So I decide to put it first. And then continue with the main rail construction. It's looking pretty good to be honest. So now we just have to put the other side and sometimes it doesn't want to snap next to the existing one for reasons. And it's looking beautifully. I would say. Here I decide to extend the rail see how the game is going to offer it to be done didn't really like it to be honest so i'm going to do it myself but also up to a point because i don't really need it right now i might connect it in the future no i might i will connect it in the future but it's not decided how yet
and of course we need some signals. After which we can also finish the connections of the station. The signals are looking fine. We have to connect our new train station as well, the main line, but also we need to make it a return route, which is going to end up being pretty nice, I would say. And again, the game does not want to offer me the things that I need, so I will have to do it myself again. Yep, still does a one. So first I'm going to extend the exit here. And then connect it with the tunnel. And there we go. Okay, we need to put signals as well here. This setup is looking very, very nice. We will also need to build connections to the other two farms that are going to be needed for the food production plant in Kansas. So that's what I'm going to do now. Unfortunately, I ended up not liking the setup, the initial one, so you will see me redoing it soon after. Yeah, it's pretty good, but I do not like having to deal with two stations. That's one of the things that I decided to change here. station should be enough figuring out where I like it the most probably in the middle is the best and yeah there is a sharp turn there but it's not such a big deal to be honest because anyhow they slow down before they go to the station I want to show you a few changes that I did. Primarily in this intersection here, you can see that we have a tunnel for the incoming traffic from New York towards the line that goes to Canada. And another tunnel for all the traffic coming from Boston towards New York and down the rails. You can see that our plastic delivery is currently using that one. Oh, and immediately we can see a tiny, tiny problem. Ooh. Oh, yes. We have too much plastics here. This is 400, right? Yes, it is. Well, let's see what's going on here. Maybe we should add a few more wagons to this trains okay that should do it awesome finances are doing good anyway so we have here the tunnel continuing and moving below all of these connections to the canada rail so that we can avoid uh, unnecessary stops of uh, traffic incoming and going to canada we also have for the usual connection over here, as you can see from under the bridge. Ah, and also, of course, this is now a bridge. It was a tunnel before. So all the passenger trains, I think, but probably there is also, let me see. Yeah, there is also cargo trains as well going through the Canada tunnel here. And yeah, 
that's it pretty much the two tunnels now the traffic is uh, much more smooth around here we have less stops okay next change let's quickly fly through the ocean and that is the bermuda setup first of all you can see that the airport is changed a little bit i have the main building in the center we have the two passenger terminals over here and we have three cargo terminals on this side i have also deleted the old station setup now we have our central station over here next to the airport as it should be and then we have one drop for all the cargo in the center of bermuda and as you can see we are already getting food fuel everything that bermuda needs hopefully it's going to continue growing to the maximum land that we have available for it we also have the central bus with one line as it was before i have also moved that station a little bit to the far end because probably it's going to grow and also this one is covering the center and this one is covering this side of the city all right i think that's pretty much here for bermuda we also have the tnc the turks and kaikos island setup i have a cargo drop here as well as you can see uh, i have also changed this station to be on that side instead as it was over here because of the port from the past all right and we have a cargo drop with two currently trucks and we have the passenger line as it was before as you can see here i also changed the buses now we have new buses man it appears that they are making better money we'll see how it goes with time all right other than that i don't think i did any changes to the airport i did not oh we have new trucks amazing and last but not least of course it's going to be new york and there is a few changes here as well you will notice that we have two more all right we have two more uh stations for uh, residents over here that's interesting maybe we will need to add one more bus here and it seems like we might need another one here as well yeah this one's a little bit further away so they will need more this one is doing good with two trams hopefully it's not going to start losing money and this one as well with these old buses maybe we can definitely change this let's see yeah i guess we can sell this one and this one we can replace with oh we just lost the one that i was using in the other lines how unfortunate I think it's going to be the GM fishbowl. It's the cheapest. And we don't need it to be fast like these guys because we are in the city. There we go. Ah, also, of course, we do not have the passenger lines passing through here. That um, test ended up not working as I expected. Now we just have a commercial line going there. Other than that, so i think that's everything but also i increased the capacity of the goods tools drop which goes to this drop over here where all the goods and tools are i'm curious if we actually yeah we do cover everything so that's pretty good and it seems like we might need to add even more which is a little bit weird because we have let's say 80 180 hmm maybe i should add another one yeah let's do it 176 now that should definitely do the trick and for the machine drop hmm 59 is reasonable i guess well we will see if it starts increasing right okay i see a lot of people here trying to go to pittsburgh you know one thing i don't like let's see this we are just going to copy this body and then we are going to edit them all and add them in one train because less trains is better 
There we go. Hopefully that's going to help. What about New York Char? Let's see here. New York Char. Okay, this can be edited into... Let's make a copy. And then we are going to edit them like this. Here we cannot have only one apparently. So let's do that. Finances are pretty, pretty good. Okay. More fixes. Let's see. Boston, Pittsburgh. That's a lot of people here. Not that many here. Ooh, Washington, Pittsburgh. Not that many. Hmm. It's unfortunate. By the way, something that I have been planning to do is to review the brick lines. I know, it's very funny. For example, this one, as you can see, is not making us good money. So we might just delete it, to be honest. I don't see many people using it. Charlotte to Nashville, maybe it's not necessary then. Well. The traffic is going to have to go in other places. Uh, let's see, manage vehicles first. Uh, we're going to sell this body for pretty much nothing. Yeah, it gave me, I think, 200,000 or something like that. And we're going to delete this line. Okay, let's see. Boston, Washington. But well, that's interesting, right? Oh, maybe they have too much capacity. So they're doing around 100 and we have 107. Hmm. Maybe what we're going to do is we're going to edit... Add these bodies here and remove one. And there we go. And see how that goes. Okay, and wash Nash. Apparently something similar. Finance is bad. We have sometimes more, sometimes less. I think I know why that is. Uh, people are like jumping from station to station when they want to go places. But we have around, what is that, 20 something? So 32 is probably too much. We can sell. Oh, they're both full. Interesting. Well, we can sell this one. Okay. Wash Savannah. Sometimes, usually around 100. That's good. And what that means also is that we have to move to only one. Okay. This one. Charts, 40, 38. Okay, let's do it. This means less trains. And I do not care if the frequency goes up. I really don't at this point. Because they don't have another choice, you know? Okay. Um, maybe we should see all the passenger lines. And then I have to check which lines have too many. Ooh. That's another prick. I think we just saw that one, right? Yeah, it's probably going to get better. Can I pause for a second? Yeah, for example, this one, we should definitely... Where do I click to go directly? I don't think I can. Okay, let's do manage vehicles. And we're going to add them together. And then we're going to open again. Can I pin this? Yes. Okay, we have two here as well. Let's do this first. Oof, I clicked it. It was a mistake. Manage vehicles. Okay. Here as well. There we go. Although this is probably going to have to lose one of them. 172. That's very interesting how we managed to get so many when our rate is 72. Hmm. Okay. That's per station. Maybe I should send them up together to get this number. I don't know. Alright. All the passenger lines have been merged and we have only one train or maximum two where it's necessary. New York, Charlotte is actually a great line producing a lot of money now very quickly i'm going to play the game and see so boston pittsburgh i think i already checked that one new york 
Pittsburgh and New York Shore. We already did that. Uh, yeah, New York, Pittsburgh. Did I already increase that? I think so, but no one can say we cannot increase it a little bit more like this. There we go. Okay, Washington, Atlanta. Ooh, this one maybe can get some. Copy, yes. There we go. Awesome. And then we have Charlotte is looking fine. Savannah, Charlotte. It's only here is big, I think. Yep. Tampa. Charlotte, Tampa and Tampa, Panama. I don't think there is many here. Charlotte, Tampa, Panama, neither here. Okay. Uh, apparently this one looks fine as well. Miami, Panama. Miami, Panama. Nope. Okay, here we have Panama, New Orleans. Oh yeah, this one. Oh yeah. Copy. And let's merge them together and see if that helps. Okay, and then we have Charlotte Panama. I don't think it had too many. Nope. Let's see. Atlanta. Everything looks fine. New Orleans. Panama already done. Tampa, New Orleans. No, it looks good. Nashville, New York, Nashville. No, it's looking fine. Wash pit. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not touching that one. This looks fine. This looks fine. Toronto, Detroit. Yeah, maybe here we can increase. Maybe. With one. Ooh, that was bad. Doesn't matter. Chicago, Pittsburgh. Chicago, Pittsburgh. Okay, let's copy. Wait. I think if I click edit and then copy. And then edit again. We are doing it the way that I want. Sure. Alright. Amazing. These ones we checked. I should also check the air later. Here in New Orleans, it was Panama and Tampa. Panama, Houston. Panama, Houston. Hmm. I think I just increased it or maybe I'm wrong. Austin looks good. Atlanta, Oklahoma. No. It's looking fine. Okay, before we connect Kansas to the rest of the network, let's check on the air. This one is looking fine. This one as well. Here as well. Uh, and the last one is this one. Now the question is... Oh... Why is that? It's full of stuff, man. Ah, maybe because it needs to land. Okay, let's see. Uh, we have Bermuda, TNC. Yeah, that one probably doesn't need too much. We have Bermuda, TNC 7 here. Bermuda, TNC 33 here. I don't think I need to do anything about that. I really think so. The rate is 7... Mm, I can add one more of those. I don't know if it's going to be better or worse. I don't have that many people here, so I don't think so. Okay, Miami, Tampa, New York. I was expecting more of this line, to be honest. 
Miami, Tampa, New York, 28 people here. And 19 people there. Miami, Tampa, New York. Hmm. Manage vehicles. I think I don't even have those anymore. What if we make them faster type uh, running costs? These are 455. These are very expensive. How much capacity these guys have? 10. These ones have 12. And I think that will be faster. Sherpa. Short 33C23 Sherpa. I think we can just replace them and see what's going on when we do that. Would be interesting. Okay. Uh, yeah, as I said, this one is now making a ton of money. New York DNC. I think the air is looking fine. I, ooh, Martin Air Cargo 747. Oh, Singapore Airlines Cargo 747. Oh, yes, baby. Nice. Hercules 11 tanker tow boat. It's a double tanker? I think so. Merlin. Oh, my God. We are getting the vehicles, man. What do we have here? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Very strong, very powerful. Yeah, that's a double tow boat. Amazing. Very nice. Is it double the power? Not really. It's kind of faster though, it says. Okay, okay. That's good to know. Cool. Now that this is out of the way, Char Savannah. Wait, not this one. Come on, Char Savannah. Hmm. 201 years. Hehe, <laughs> that's one of the oldest vehicles I think that I have. Okay, I think it's time to connect Kansas to other places. Kansas is kind of central, right? Uh, okay, let's see. Come on, Kansas. Hello. So, new line from Kansas to Nashville, I guess. Okay. And on Kansas is going to take those. Sure. Let's start from number six and then five and four. And in Nashville is on the right. But did it take the right? Three or six. Three and then one, two, four, five, six. Cool. And this is... Uh, what is this? Passenger rail commuter service. And we have Kansas Nash. Okay. Now we need some trains. Wow, I actually do not have maybe this one. I guess I can use that one. Let's see what's going to be my new trains, because I have no idea at this point. Uh, okay, we have these guys. I need something that is very cheap, I guess. And goes fast. I guess these, these guys? The Alco PA. They are very cheap. And I don't need power or anything. They're pretty fast, actually. I don't know if I will manage these speeds, but... Okay, let's add this, and then we can add... Some wagons. This guy can do 188. Maybe these ones. They're actually kind of cheap as well. Maybe not as cheap as these ones, but... They're heavier. Hmm... I can do the 150. Let's start with this. And add it to Kansas. Kansas Nash. Cool. Very cool. 
Um, I will keep this here because I would like to copy this. This uh, train. And after that, uh, connect to Chicago. And I think that's going to be it. Oklahoma is super close. Sure. I might have a connection in the future, but for now, just Chicago. So, Kansas, Chicago, customer, passengers, rail, customer, commuter service, um, Kansas, Chicago. All right, and in Kansas should be on the right again. Five is fine, and ten is four and six. And on Chicago, number... Ah, nothing is taken on this side, so you can take number 14. And then it's 9 to 14. Uh, yes, but can I have it? Yeah, it looks... It looks very, very, very nice. Here as well. Okay, so now I want to manage these vehicles. Copy, and then this guy, we are going to assign it to Kansas Chicago. All right. Looking very good. Let's not forget that we need to bring these people. We need to bring these people. I think one passenger bus stop over here is going to be great for now this is going to be can kansas res one okay and what about the drops i do not have i do not have good coverage right no i have zero coverage which in this case means we should probably take two drops because I don't... But actually, technically, I can drop everything with one of them. Okay, that's that's fair. And okay, let's put it here in the middle. This is going to be... Kansas. Cargo. Drop. And now we just need two lines. One from here to there and that is of course public transportation kansas rs1 we are going to give it the green color and maybe like that amazing okay let's put it here because we need to uh give it a vehicle and then from the cargo to the drop it's going to be cargo truck kansas cargo drop and in the city kansas city it should be kansas central cargo okay and here is only a load load okay sure put this one there okay kansas residential one we have fire running costs we have yeah this is definitely a city bus so let's assign it to the city and then we need cargo oh cargo running costs yeah i think it's this boys to the cargo drop Oh, that's pretty good. I think I will not need many more for now. Ooh, absolutely not. Kansas is tiny at the moment. Okay, that, you see, we already have our passengers. It's very interesting, this for me, and I do not understand what's going on here. No one wants to consume the food. What? In the North Distribution Center. Ah, oh my god. I forgot 
to click one button. And there we go. We are going to start to have some shipment now. Well, mistakes happen. Losing a lot of money happens. <laughs> All right. Okay, now we have Kansas. Oh my goodness. Connected to the rest of the system. And it should start growing. Do we have supply? Yeah, we have machines. Some food. Let's see. This should start going up. Yep, yeah, slowly but surely. We are going to expect that to go up. Alright, so we have to connect this grain production. Let's see, I did not create the lines here, so let's add it. Like this. Of course, let's put this one here. This is grain. And it's going to be a truck. Kansas grain supply. There we go. Interesting. That would be many of them. Farm four, farm seven, farm five. I guess they will be called Kansas grain supply. I don't know. That's that. That's it. It's decided. <laughs> okay. Manage line, you will load. This will be Kansas Farm 4. Kansas Farm Form, Kansas. Green, Kansas Farm 4. And then grain supply? I think that's going to work. Okay, let's do it like that. Uh, and this one is going to be Kansas Farm... What is it? Seven. Kansas Farm Seven. And they're going on the correct side, which is great. And they're just going to unload the grain. Perfect. We just need to have a grain. These boys, of course. And the rate is oh, almost there. Oh, that's going to hurt. No, <laughs> I need 200. Uh, well, it is what it is. New line. From here to there, and this is going to be... What are you? Let's put you there. Kansas Farm 4. Okay, wait. First cargo truck. Kansas... No, that's Kansas Farm 7. Grain supply. Let's give it the grain color. Uh, and then the station is Kansas Farm 7. And this one is going to be Kansas, Kansas Farm 7 Cargo Rail. Good. Alright. Uh, we, of course, need... The same buddies. We we'll go to farm seven as well, and this is going to be two hundred and ten twenty, and this is going to be four hundred and forty-five. Sure. Oh, uh, this is going to bother me a lot, but it is what it is. All right. This is okay. This is nicely built here. I think I have to choose this depot. 
and locomotive locomotives i don't think i will be able to reach any speeds so running costs matter this one has 4000 horsepower and it's kind of slow but it's also expensive twice as much as this guy let's start with one of those and then we will see okay and then we have rain uh i think it should be the cheap ones i did not create a line from here to there here it's going to be uh that's interesting why no go to one and two and you're also green and this is going to be cargo rail supply and we're going to have uh kansas grain supply something like that we have 30 this is very interesting i need 600 so 20 of those buddies that's 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 18 20 596 Ooh. let's manage this vehicle and give it a nice green color okay we have shipment actually is this mother mediocre hmm. in 1300 meters and i have how much do i have yeah i think this can be we can get a better locomotive maybe uh this one right yep this is definitely going to be better now so that means i should probably sell two of those we will see how it goes where is the train Ah, this is the new passenger trains. Look at that. Very sexy. 85, 86. Why? Because this one is too slow or something. This one is slow. Why is that? Interesting. We already have our passengers here, which is very, very nice to see. This one is getting the shipment. Which is good to see as well. These guys here. They are not doing much, are they? Ooh, uh, I guess you can use the other one as well. But I doubt that you need it. Right, you're using two. Uh, how is this Kansas Farm 7? This is seven. Oh, that's five. Okay. What's the big deal here? Why are we not? Ah, we are producing actually. But these buddies are not producing. Yeah, because that farm is still on level one. Well, that's going to start working, I'm pretty sure. Eventually. Kansas buddy, please, you have to start growing. Wow, we already have emissions. Ooh. ah maybe because oh wow okay let's copy but also let's not forget this is very very important we do not want to see emissions dropping the growth of the city poor people look at them okay okay this is growing and i like it maybe we can give it more 
um, wagons, right? What's this one? Let's see. How about the other one? The other one, not so much. Not yet, at least. Kansas, Chicago. Yeah, Kansas is too, too tiny. Too small. Oh, wow. And it should start growing like today. Come on. The rapid growth experience by the city, man. <laughs> oh, yes. Hello there. All right. Uh, this is the grain, right? Yeah, it's not bringing anything yet. Oh, but it's at 80 kilometers. Super fast. That's good. It's going to cost me money, maybe, this... Uh... Good. 600 meters. Nah, I think, it's, I think it's fine. I think it's fine. I don't have enough space here to, to get some speed, that's for sure. So I think I'm going to leave it at that. It's going to block the super fast trains around here, probably. We'll see if I get some better locomotives in the future, although it's 1991. So I'm not so sure that's going to happen. Okay, we have eight, seven consumers. Yeah, this guy has to get the transport of the food. And then we're going to grow. Good, good. Good to see. Let's make a quick review. Very poor. Interesting. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, I think we are going to change things around here. Yep, I don't think we need that many trains. So one thing we're going to do is move everyone up. The 311, okay. 328. I will have. Yeah, all of these trains. Hmm. Let's do that. Okay, let's modify like this. Or maybe there is a traffic jam of some kind. That's also. Could be slowing things down. Is it? Uh, there's plenty of trains around here. That's going to Chicago. Where are you going? Uh -huh. There actually is some... Where are you going? Okay, there. So who are you guys waiting for? I don't understand. Like, the rest of them are free. This guy. Okay, you're just crossing. I really hate that amount of waiting that we are experiencing around here. I really don't like it. Well, it's actually not that many trains, but I don't understand why they cannot, like, share the, the rails here better. I mean, I understand everyone has to cross around here, but... Sometimes it's kind of weird. Okay, these boys. Going fast. Very nice. Okay, okay. Yeah, bringing the fuel. Very nice. Wow, this, this setup here looks amazing, I think. What's going on here? 898, that should be enough. Zero planks. Hmm. Not good, not good. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Doesn't want to. Is it possible that I did something so that this guy cannot expand or something? Ah, there you go. Auto-create on. Airbus uh, 
320. Did you see that? And we have the GE something something. I didn't see it. New vehicles. I like new vehicles. Okay, that's the call. Uh, okay, so we have a problem here. And where did it go? Over here. What are you waiting for? That was very interesting for me. Go, go, go. Yeah, I know you're very heavy. Okay, let's continue. Do I have enough space? No, I don't think so. I have 17, 13. I can get four here, four here. 12, 14, so I cannot remove, uh, maybe I can remove one of these ones, but then I will need one more, and maybe I just have to increase them, yeah, okay, so this boy, let's make them equal, so you go here, and then 294 is what we are going to look at, okay, like that, 16, 13, 14, 13. Maybe if I make them all 16, that's going to help. Let's see. Cargo. This boy. And then the call is completely forgot everything. I don't think it matters. 60, 94, 94, 94. 16, 1567. Okay, so that didn't do it. So they have to be full trains. Or nothing, it appears. Well, at least I removed one train, which is always a benefit. 1651. Okay, that's fine. We can remove three, I guess. One, two, three. Sixteen or nine. Okay, that looks good. That looks very good. And hopefully we are going to have a solution. With the call here soon enough. Okay. Uh, mediocre Panama City. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we can replace you with a new... This boy. There you go. From 25 to 42. This should help. Or GM Cargo. Oh, oh. Okay. Uh, I think the solution here is fairly straightforward. Let's give you some some of those and you will definitely have enough now and we have Fares 2 I think I already did that oh Pittsburgh PA Central 1700 is not enough somehow okay I don't know what to do about this anymore though this should be plenty we have yeah well, I don't know. What I know is that this will mark the end of today's episode. Share your thoughts for the Denver expansion in the comment section. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't already. As always, thank you for watching.